Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, thanks for stopping by and don't forget to hit that like button and the subscribe and the bell. You'll see all my future videos. If you're one of my regulars, thanks again for sticking around and thanks for your support. Today I'm going to go through some nail nail. And I also purchased uh, these seven uh, kiss gels at the dollar store. I did put two coats and a top coat of ice, high shine top coat on all of these. So I'm going to run through what I got. First of all, um, Braves Diva Nails are the first two. Uh, and I got these on her last sale and there's bravesdivanail.com she is awesome and these polishes are wonderful there's her instagram youtube and facebook all her information and she wants you to stalk her <laughs> so the first two i purchased is this gorgeous yellow cream it is called drew if I turn that around, you could probably read it. And this is Drew on a swatch stick, two coats for the top coat. Gorgeous yellow. I don't have, I only have maybe two yellows in my collection, but nothing, nothing like this. Uh, these are one coaters. I do twos, but that's just my personal. Here's the other one from Braves Diva. And I love the name of this one. Crime Dogs Press Box Fire. There's a story behind this. Um, and if you go to Tara's page, she explains the whole story behind naming of some of these polishes. She's a huge baseball fan, so a lot of this has to do with that. So, of uh, of course, I'm drawn to purples everywhere, anything that I'm wearing. <laughs> and this is uh, two coats with a top coat. Beautiful. Again, another one coater, depending on your application. Formula is wonderful on these. They are five free. And Tara mixes these herself. So it's a wonderful indie brand. And um, five free, hand mixed. If someone would cooperate, there we go. Five free hand mixed braids, even nails. So these are the only two I grabbed in the last post, but um, she's coming up again. I believe on the 16th of March she's gonna sell again. So keep a watch out for that. First one up I did use a couple of weeks ago. Last week, oh February. Um, Valentine's Day for our anti-Valentine uh, weekly collab. This is a solid black. Gorgeous, gorgeous polish, kiss gel, and the name of this one is Express. So, two coats with a top coat. It is a one coater. The second one, this pretty gel. Uh, these are gels, but you don't have to... Um, Put them in a light so they're gel like polishes but great formulas on these off the hook this is again two coats with the top coat uh these are wonderful formulas and this one's a little streaky but it does settle down after it dries down the next one is, of course, more purple, because I can't handle not having purple. I can't tell you how pretty this is, and I don't know if the camera is going to let you see the reflect in here. Maybe not, but there is tiny little micro glitters that are, a, I'm going to say they're about fuchsia. Very tiny. Maybe you could see it right there. Gorgeous polish. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, that one is called Necessity. 
Can you see it? Oh, there we go. You can see it in the bottle. Pretty. Love it. The next one is Debut. This is another gorgeous purple. And there's tiny, tiny micro glitters in here. I see fuchsia. Maybe some purple. I don't know. I can't tell. They're really tiny. But gorgeous polish. Gorgeous. Again, one coater, but I did two. And debut. Beautiful polish. I'm going to attempt to water marble with these and stamp with a couple because I'd like to see if they do stamp. The next one is kind of a dark brick red. In the bottle, it looks really brown. <laughs> well, I thought it was brown. It looks brown. This one is called Partner. Beautiful color. Great dark red. The next one up is Attitude. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous red. I'm not a red fan, but this one is really pretty. Uh, deep, deep red. Here, I'm going to try that. Maybe that'll help. Deep red. A true red. This last one is called B1 Top. I have no idea what that means, but you can catch the fuchsia, tiny little fuchsia micro glitters. Maybe, I don't know, maybe some type of a duo to it, but I don't know if you can catch them on the swatch stick, but look at that. Super pretty. They are fuchsia I'm going to go with. Um, I, don't, I can. I'm trying to get you guys to see it. Oh, there we go. Now you can see it. Maybe a duochrome with these fuchsias in here, but another one. These are from the Dollar Tree. They are a dollar. And if anyone wants any, just leave me a comment down below and I'll pick them up and send them to you. Um, you could pay shipping and whatever. We'll work it out. Maybe trade for more purple. Anyway, I am going to try and see if these stamp. Okay, so off camera, I did a few things. Sorry for the littles, just trying to get you in frame. This camera moves a lot. Um, I'm going to share with you, I did purchase this um, Bundle Monster, or I'm sorry, Born Pretty L047. I hadn't pulled it out because I was going to use it for spring, but I did use this plate to stamp with the Kiss Gels. And I will show you, this one stamps awesome. <laughs> Work with me. There we go. They all stamp really, really good. I put this red, the shimmery red. Oh, oh, sorry. This is the purple. <laughs> the purple over the top of that shimmer red. It's really pretty. And let's see, the black one I put over just an old um, practice nail swatch stick, but the black does stamp. They all stamped great. It was just a matter of, um, this one is actually the pink on purple. It kind of came out a little silver. Oh, come on. There we go. Really pretty. I'd say this was quite the review of my Kiss Gels in this uh, BPL 047. This one shocked me. I'm going to move the light a little better. This one shocked me a lot. Look how like it's stamped in a lighter purple color. More purple than red or fuchsia. I, I don't know. I guess I'm stuck on that word today. This was an old nail I did with those um, glass, glass-like sheets, you know, broken glass. But check that out. It is so pretty on this nail. I love the background. 
but it's stamped so pretty and that broken glass effect in the background is what an awesome accidental anyway I'm not the best water marbler in the world don't even claim to be I need a lot more practice at water marbling but oh these are two other colors I have uh, kiss gels they stamped perfectly really cute love this plate too so outside of the plate, uh, the Braves, ne Braves Diva Nails uh, did stamp as well. Both the Drew and the Crime Dog, Crime Dog's Press Box Fire, that's the purple one. And what else do I want to show you? Oh, Water Marbling. So um, mostly with the purples, I played around. These were the two reds and the pink one. Again, I'm not a water marbler. I should try spend more time on it. I just don't like to waste polish, and I guess that's what it feels like. Um, let me know if you can see this one. Here, let's try that. No? No. Oh. It worked. This one's really pretty, too. I did it over black. Oh, my lighting today is just worthless. Um, this one's over black. Really cute. There's another purple one. Those uh, two purples and the shimmery pink one. I, think I use that on most of them. Again, I'm not a water marbler. But they did turn out pretty cute. And the last one, how cute is that? I actually pulled something off. Water marbling. All right, light, you are irritating me today. Just not getting the right light for you guys to see this. I actually water marbled. All right, so um, that's that. I just wanted to share all that with you guys and uh, see you in the next video. Thanks for sticking around. Catch you later. Bye.